to back with Thompson. Wilkshire. Now Bresciano. Bresciano to curl it. Kennedy! Is that the goal that takes Australia to Brazil? It's big Josh Kennedy. Cue delirium in Sydney. At last, they found the goal that they so desperately craved. And it's come courtesy of the substitute. Well, I credit the coach, Holger Osek, who was brave enough to take off the main man, Timmy Cale, and throw in Josh Kennedy. Timmy Cale will say, give me one cross like that. I'd have finished it too. And it's a very convincing move. Substitute Archie Thompson settling things. Quick play, Luke Wilkshire. Beautiful measured cross from Mark Bresciano. And it's the tall timber of Josh Kennedy who rises high from eight yards and nails the header. And maybe Australia are on the way to Rio. Well, look at the reaction on the bench. Holger Osik. Well, he's a genius, wasn't he? We were questioning whether he'd made the right decision five minutes ago. That's why the coaches get paid the big bucks. And his decision has paid dividends. Maybe between 10 and 15 million dollars worth of dividends in terms of World Cup qualification. If that is what it is to mean, Andy. No. On we go, but only for a few seconds more. Australia have done it. It is three in a row for the Socceroos. They are the nation's darlings once again as they book their tickets for Brazil. It has been a long, hard road with plenty of stumbles along the way. But Australia once again dine at the top table of world football a year from now. Holger Osik smiles and hugs Tim Cahill. The angst of the last 18 months is forgotten. A debate on personnel on and off the park and wait for another day. Tonight is about qualification and celebration. And Josh Kennedy's late goal was enough. Australia have done it. Brazil, here we come.